I know lately my YouTube has been kind of negative, but tonight we're going to do something positive. We're going to support local businesses because I believe that supporting local businesses is important. You need to shop local. Everybody should shop local. I don't believe in shopping at Amazon or even Target or Walmart. You should support local businesses. If you sh live in Brooklyn, you really shouldn't be shopping in Manhattan. You should be shopping at locally at your local stores. So tonight I'm going to highlight some businesses in Crown Heights that you can shop at that I support. There's fake news that I write bad Yelp reviews. I've really written a lot of positive Yelp reviews about businesses in Crown Heights. And tonight I'm going to share some of the businesses I support and some of the great Yelp reviews I've written about them so that you can check them out. If you're Jewish, non-Jewish, they're great businesses that you can go to in Crown Heights because you should support your local businesses that are in your neighborhood. So we're going to start with the marketplace. The marketplace is located at 589 East New York Avenue, Brooklyn, New York, 11225. This is their website. The great thing about the marketplace is not only can you shop there, but you can also get delivery from there. They have a really, really easy to use website. It's easy to navigate. It's very easy to order from their website. And also they have an app, so you can also order from the app. And also if you shop at their grocery store, if you don't want to carry this stuff home, as long as you shop the minimum amount, they'll deliver it to your house from the grocery store. It's really, really simple, simple, simple to shop there. And they have everything you need at their grocery store. It's really, really a great option to go and shop at the marketplace. And now I'm going to read the Yelp review that I wrote about them. So this is what I wrote. I said, since I last wrote my last review, the marketplace seems stricter about enforcing mask policy. Almost everyone is wearing a mask in their store now. Several times I went, they had an employee by their front door making sure that people were coming and wearing masks. Also, since I had a negative experience with their mask situation in their store before, I tried them out for delivery. I must say their deliveries are awesome. It's so easy and convenient. Ordering online is super simple. They deliver right to your door if you have any issues with your order. They are very cooperative in fixing it. Delivery is a great option to use with them if you don't want to go to their store. So I want to say something about what I said about the masks. At one point, Marketplace was not very strict on the masks. They have gotten very, very strict on the mask thing. If you go on Marketplace, everybody is wearing a mask. Employees, customers, everybody is wearing a mask. They are very, very strict on it now, extremely strict on it. So you can feel confident that you are safe shopping in Marketplace. Great place to shop. Everything you need, wonderful prices, and it's very easy and very, very convenient. If you don't feel safe going to the grocery store or you don't want to schlep from your house, delivery is a great option with them. So let's go to the next place. Let's go to... Um, let's go to... Uh, Kettle and Cord. So Kettle and Cord is located at 398 Kingston Avenue in Brooklyn, New York, 11225. Okay, and here's their website. Okay, they do do delivery because I've had stuff delivered with them before, they actually saved me during PaySock. Like I really, really needed um, stuff for PaySock and they actually saved me. They actually delivered my stuff right before PaySock and I actually had to have any dishes for PaySock because it was my first time doing PaySock at home and they actually, they actually saved me for PaySock. I'm very, very thankful to Kettle and Cord. They actually, if it weren't for them, I wouldn't have had um, stuff to cook my stuff at home for PaySock. So I'm very, very thankful to Kettle and Cord. They're an amazing place. They have all your home cooking needs. Um, yeah, they're they're just they're really, really great. So I'm going to share the Yelp review that I wrote about them. It might have something to do with Pesach or might have something to do with something else. Not sure. Don't remember because I think I wrote it a long time ago.
Okay, here we go. I wrote here, the customer service here is superb. They even gift wrapped my item. I went inside and asked for a gift that I could bring to a friend in my suitcase that wouldn't break, that would be good for her kitchen. They recommended a beautiful recipe book, which you can insert your own recipes in. It was a perfect gift. My friend loved it when I gave it to her. It is a beautiful store with a large variety of kitchen and household items. Their prices are very reasonable for Kingston Avenue. They have a mikvah in their store, which is for public use. By the way, the past two um, places that I've talked about, Marketplace and Kettle Cord, I both gave five stars. And um, yeah, so I had picked up this lovely gift at Kettle Cord for a friend. And yeah, my friend absolutely, she adored it. It was, she loved it so much. Okay, so we're gonna go to the next place. Let's see here. Next place we're going to talk about is Judaic World, which is my favorite Judaica store in Crown Heights. And they are located at 329 Kingston Avenue, 11213. And their website is, this is their website. And we're going to look at the Yelp review that I wrote about them. Okay, so I wrote, very nice store. Staff here is friendly and helpful, and the prices are good. I found a great price on a Hubdullah candle holder. It is less expensive there than at the other store on the street. Yeah, Judaica World has the best prices on most of the Judaica stuff. Um, yeah, and I found um, a lot of amazing stuff there. So here's a picture of something that I got at Judaica World. See if this picture will blow up. Yeah, this is something very, very beautiful that I got at Judaica World. Um, I got this amazing, this is not what I wrote the review about, but I got it later on. I got this amazing Shabbos candle holder at Judaica World. Um, this tea light holder at Judaica World. Okay, so this goes to the next. See, I don't write negative Yelp reviews. Look at all these positive Yelp reviews. Look at all these five-star reviews I've written of amazing Crown Heights businesses. See, this goes to the next business. Um, okay, we'll go Beef and Bun. Okay, so Beef and Bun is located at 271 Kingston Avenue, Brooklyn, New York, 11213. This is their website. This is their website. Okay. And we will read the Yelp review that I wrote about them. Um, let's see here. See here. I'm having a hard time finding the restaurant on Yelp because I'm not sure if I'm spelling it correctly. Here we go. Okay, this is what I wrote. I went there for lunch with friends and a couple a couple opening comments on this place. It's a pretty pricey kosher burger place, but you get what you pay for. They have huge burgers. They come in different varieties. They add a gratuity charge for the bill. Just a heads up. Our waiter was excellent. 
he was attentive and courteous. They first served my friend's burgers. Our food all came out at separate times. Their burgers, my burgers and the fries, my friend's burgers came cold. The waiter took them back. He returned with fresh burgers, hot for them 10 minutes later. I ordered morning scramble burger, which was delicious. My egg and bacon on the burger was wonderful. My fries that I had with it was with, had with a great mayonnaise that had some spice added to it. The waiter informed us that they made an extra burger for me and allowed us to take one that one home free of charge. For dessert, I had fried Oreos with ice cream. It was so delicious. Altogether, the experience at the restaurant was good. It just would have been better if the food was brought out together. I respected the restaurant when we complained about the original burgers. They had no hesitation to take them away and brought us new ones. I would definitely return. So this review that's only four stars was actually from 2016. Okay. I've actually been there like four times since then. And I want to say that the service has been impeccable. I've been to their outdoor dining. Their outdoor dining is amazing. The food has been amazing. And I always have the morning scramble, which is this burger. When I go there, it's my favorite burger there. But my friend tried their vegan burger. And my friend thought their vegan burger was just amazing. I don't know if I have a picture of it on my Yelp. But my friend thought their vegan burger was just incredible. Like, he thought it was just out of this world. So I highly recommend them. I know I had a couple complaints on this visit, but this was from four years ago. But every time I've gone since then, I haven't had one complaint about anything with the restaurant. Everything was 100%, 100% perfect. But even, see here, when they made a mistake, they were so, 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 so picky to correct it. Like they tried, they bent over backwards to correct it. And that shows how important customer service to them is. That shows a good restaurant. Like everybody makes a mistake every once in a while, but they work so hard to correct it. And that really shows a good restaurant right there. Okay, let's go to the next place. See, that shows a good restaurant. When when they make a mistake, they don't sit there and blame the customer. They don't sit there and, and make excuses. They correct things, and they apologize. That shows a good restaurant. So we're going to go to Crown Heights Rosary next. So this is Crown Heights Rosary. They don't have a website, but they're located at 312 Kingston Avenue, 11213. And I'm going to go to my Yelp review about them. Let me see. I have to share a separate screen. Okay, so this is what I wrote about them. I said, I went to this hosiery store today after leaving another hosiery store because the people weren't wearing masks. I saw how, I want to say how impressed I am on how much everybody was wearing masks and social distancing. Everyone was wearing masks in the stores, all the employees, all the customers. They were only letting so many people in the store. I felt so comfortable shopping there. Plus, they had everything I needed at a reasonable price. The staff was so friendly and helpful. They even said that they delivered locally if needed. So I want to say that about this store. This store is really amazing. They are so mass compliant. Like every time I go there, I've been there several times since I went that time. And they are so mass compliant and so into social distancing. You feel so safe shopping there. And they're so nice. Last time I went there, I picked up a little purse. And the woman was so nice and so patient. Cause I was like, so like undecided on if I want to buy it, if I didn't want to buy it, it didn't even cost that much, but she was so patient and so kind. And she took so much time to show me what I need to see. Just really appreciate all the help she gave me. Yeah. So that was really nice. Okay. We're going to the next place. Okay. All right. We're going to go to Mendy's. Okay, Mendy's is located at, 
It just says it's located in the Jewish. Um, let's see, it says it's located in the Jewish Children's Museum. And the address is 792 Eastern Parkway, Brooklyn, New York, 11213. And they have a website. You can order from them online. Actually, my friend, when we went there the other day, he liked it so much that he decided he's going to start getting delivery from them. He had their falafel, and he liked it so much that he decided that he's going to start ordering delivery from them because he enjoyed their food so much. He decided he, he they got a new customer. He had never been there before. I'm a regular customer there. But he said he's going to start getting... Um, delivery from them. He really enjoyed their falafel. So this is what I wrote about them. I said, I'm now a big fan of this place. I love their chicken fingers with barbecue sauce and onion rings. So delicious. It was a reasonable price. Their food comes quick. The service is friendly. They now have limited outdoor dining. The place is a great place to get a quick bite to eat or take out. See, this is a picture of me at the outdoor dining. See this picture? See if I can scroll down. If I can scroll down, I can't. Okay, so this is a picture of me at the outdoor dining. Um, yeah, they have outdoor dining there. Um, and I usually order the chicken fingers with the onion rings. That's my regular thing that I buy there. But Mendy's is great because it's a reasonable price for a meat place. I can order chicken fingers for like, I think it's like $8. And the onion rings are like $6. And my friend ordered a falafel for $5. And it looked really, really good. It looked amazing. He said he really enjoyed it. Okay, let's go to the next one. Okay. Um, okay, so let's see, we have one left. And I I think, I'm not very good at pronouncing these kind of names. But I'm going to try to pronounce it. It's called Makon Stam. This is where I get my mezuzahs checked. Now, they are located, I actually added them to help Yelp. They're located at 415 Kingston Avenue, Brooklyn, New York, 11225. This place is amazing. Okay? This place is amazing. I, I can't say how great this place is. I mean, you don't get your mezuzahs checked that often, but this place is great because anytime you have a question, you can call them and they answer any questions you have. Plus, you can email them. And when you do an order with them, like they text you when your stuff is ready. They have this great like texting system. They send you a text when your order is ready. They call you. They, they're just really, really great at notifying you. Like it's really, really convenient the way they have everything set up. They have a really, really cool system where they do things. And they're very, very quick. And they're, and they're fairly inexpensive too. So let me just read the Yelp review I did about them. They're just the whole, the whole way their whole system is set up is really, really good and convenient. And they also do an extremely good job. You know, when that big controversy came out about the people checking the mezuzahs in Crown Heights, um, they actually are one of the legit people that check mezuzahs. Um, I went here to get my mezuzahs checked. Um, they did an amazing job. The staff here is so professional, patient, and helpful. They answered all my questions. Uh, they called me and updated me as soon as they checked my mezuzahs and told me what repairs are needed. They explained to me everything. They were very helpful. Aaron, who works there, is phenomenal with customers. I was very satisfied with the job they did. I went there because they were recommended by a local rabbi. I would definitely recommend them to others. Yeah, so this place is really, 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 really good. Um, so that's just a few places I would recommend in Crown Heights. There's a lot of places I left out. You can check out my Yelp. Like my Yelp has tons of reviews about amazing places in Crown Heights. So I just wanted to list a few because I wanted to do a positive YouTube. And um, I wanted to just highlight some great places that you should go to, that you should check out here in Crown Heights. That might have been a little bit of a boring YouTube just listening to me read, but hopefully people check it out. Hopefully they'll get some likes. I feel like when I complain, people listen to me more than when I say positive things. But hopefully this will get a few views. So like, share, and subscribe. Okay, have a great day, everybody.